At Brainway University, we take immense pride in our association with NPTEL or National Programme on Technology Enhanced Learning, one of India's most prestigious e-learning platform and courses. Through these courses, our students are gaining global standard skills. And today we have with us four of our esteemed faculty members who have acted as in-house mentors to guide students throughout their NPTEL journey including producing gold medalists and toppers. First, we have with us Dr. Shivnath Ghosh from the Department of Computer Science and Engineering, who has till now mentored over 200 students. Hello, sir. Good morning. Good morning. So I wanted to ask that uh, the NPTEL course that you're mentoring for, it focuses on programming languages, right? And yeah. it's a very important course for our CAC students. Yeah, sure. But how is this course actually helping them along with our existing curriculum? Yeah, thank you very much. This is a very important and essential question for all uh, CAC students, means computer science and engineering background students. Because I would like to say that as the educations, that includes itself five vowels. And mm -hmm. as we know that the importance of vowels means Hindi Mamose Kahitne Swar. Without vowels, without vowels, we cannot utter a single word, we cannot frame a sentence as we know that. Means the existence of the language that is not possible without such vowels. So we know that the importance of vowels. Similarly, without programming language, computer science we cannot think about. So programming language is essential for the computer science. Okay. And so you have also mentored over 200 students for this course, right? So that is a huge responsibility. So my last question is, what would you say is the key to their success and how do you approach mentoring these students? Although uh, our, in our university, uh, we have a rich as well as advanced syllabus that includes basics to advanced level. Okay. Yeah. Whereas, we encourage our students and we nurture our students' interest. That's why we prefer uh, such NPTEL courses. And such NPTEL courses, it working like a bridge between education to industry. Now we will hear from our faculty members from the Department of Law who have successfully mentored gold medalists as well as top students. Hello sir, so my question to you is uh, why do you think it is important for students to enroll for NPTEL courses? What can they learn from these apart from classroom? So very good questions. Actually the thing is that the NPTEL basically is known as NIPS, Massive Open Online Courses. In this domain you will have more than 3000 courses are there. And these courses are designed on the basis of the latest requirement of the industry. And the students and the faculties, I would like to tell you that IITs, IIA, and other reputed institutions, the faculties are involved with these. And the materials which are really quality materials, categorically, which is very important for the students, they can be able to learn the things from the most renowned faculties from Peter India. That is the real opportunities to get. And once they receive the certificates, you know that there is a different kind of certification they are providing for them. Once they obtain the certificates, they embed it in their resume. It will be very much accepted by the industries and when they are appearing in the interview. They are highly acknowledged this kind of credential apart from the traditional teaching methodology. That is the one of the lucrative opportunities they had this. And along with this, I want to mention that it is an absolutely free course. No one asking money for it. So that is also another parameter which we encourage the students to enroll more and more. And there is no part that you have to enroll only one course. You can enroll number of courses at a one at a one tenure. That is also most important opportunities because they can access at least the quality resources which are really react to get. Suppose a student is in being all. They are starting the good universities, but they still looking for the interact with the IITs. Those are IITs, IIMs, and other reputed institu institutions. They are getting these opportunities from them. So that may be the one of the major factors that will act up with these students. 
So uh, you also mentioned that these courses are designed as per industry requirements, right? Yes. So how do these courses bridge the gap between theory and practical? Okay, madam, this is also a very good question that how students can minimize the gap between the industry and academia, that is the question, okay? So I think as per my experience is concerned, I can tell you that the faculties, this, those are already have some projects, some industry experiences, they are actually 40 years, 50 years industry experiences, they are also used to take the latest technological courses with the students. And so that actually what is going right now in the industry, what is the requirement of the industry, they are designed their courses according to that need only. So that if the students are doing this kind of courses along with their traditional courses, so they will be able to know and interact the latest technology. So you cannot have this practical exposure unless you join and you interact with the faculties. Those are actually interacted with the industry in daily basis. So that is the most important thing. Suppose I will tell you one thing. Suppose strata. People are not aware about the strata too much. Those are doing researches, okay. But if you join in the APTL, you can have this access that somebody from the IIT's research cell, they will use to take the classes in the strata. So students may have some fear factor regarding strata, but then when they are joining with these courses, they are able to get know that the important and latest technologies that will help them out. Hello, sir. So my first question to you is the course that you're mentoring students for right now, it focuses on constitutional studies. So how do you think this is going to help our students in their career? You have asked a very pertinent question, ma'am. Relating to the constitution, but it is the period of all the laws. So the students will be very much enriched and we are finding here that environmental governance along with the constitution which is very helpful for the students they are practicing in the high court in the supreme court and also in the lower courts where we cannot find anything ignoring the provisions of the constitution moreover the laws which are to be drafted they should align with the constitution otherwise it will happen what that if they constitution we are ignoring it then the laws will be called for it so there is a need for the students to know the constitution well and these course of NPTEL will not only focus about the constitution and also about the environmental governance and along with the environmental laws too in this way it is very much helpful okay and my final question to you is how are these uh, course is going to help in terms of competitive job exams in the job market. This course has immense help in the competitive examination. Like I will be telling that Nick said, there the environmental oriented question along blending with constitution it comes, which I have found in this course. This is very helpful for the students to clear their doubts before approaching the master degree and also it is helpful because they are also learning the environmental law and the constitution they have learned or they will be learning which which will be helpful for them to meet their future goals and also we, we are finding that in AIB there is a course which is called the all India basis examination it is to be given and there is also constitution and it will be helpful for the students to achieve success. All right. Hello, ma'am. Hello. My first question is, uh, NPTN courses are designed for self-learning, right? So as a mentor, how are you helping the students and what kind of guidance can they expect from our teachers? Uh, ma'am, um, as a mentor, always my duty, uh, primary duty is to help the students from the date of enrollment to last date, that is their examination. Throughout the courses, I help them um, for in every uh, moment when they ask me for some help uh, so that they can complete their syllabus and get maximum benefit from it. And secondly, um, I encourage them to focus on those subjects which complement their syllabus and it may again uh, broaden their knowledge in their, beyond their curriculum. And along with this, I organize a different group, WhatsApp group, for um, giving constant 
motivational message as well as their update of the course specifically for uh, submission of the assignment within due time i give them some constructive uh, message or constructive feedback our institute also provide their uh, them by providing uh, sufficient books in our uh, library as well as uh, computer lab with internet connection so that they can access the, all the information uh, promptly uh, university also providing uh, training for communication skill right and my final question is since you mentioned curriculum uh, what advice would you give to students uh, who find it difficult to balance that the is course with the kind of thing ma'am um because uh, for gaining the knowledge and uh, the getting success in these courses two things are very important one is the discipline another thing is the time management they have to make a schedule for online courses as well as the classroom curriculum i encourage them to choose those subjects which complements their curriculum so here some uh, gap may be fulfilled and uh, i ask them any time they may call me for um, getting any kind of help and uh, so that they can uh, bridge their gap in studies and for them thing is that they must be consistent in their studies and ultimately uh, it is the my my another uh, advice always in to them that they must uh, revise the syllabus thoroughly throughout the course and submit it promptly immediately without waiting for a rush this year brinwa university proudly hosted the nptel award ceremony to honor the top performers and our medalists our mentors and the diverse range of nptel courses are helping our students prepare for the world beyond brinwa so stay tuned for more such updates